Hey guys, this is Jackie Pan here well, with uh, Mobile Bun. Hi guys. And we are finishing The Last Door, which is a game we started a long time ago and never finished. Okay, go ahead. Okay. I hope you guys remember what we did last episode. Hi, old lady. You talk to her first. Good evening, sister. Sister? Oh, what are you suffering? Christ. All our prayers unanswered. Oh, what do you mean, sister? I'm not gonna do the voice. <laughs> All these years entrusted to the Lord, praying, looking for a sign. Ooh. Why are you right click? <laughs> My bad. For something that can give me strength. Every day I hear them cry, pray, scream, and die. And what for? Where are you, Lord? Why don't you answer me? Ooh. First time. Maybe there is no Lord. Oh, it's the gate. You gonna make her an atheist now? What should we do then? What is our living purpose? I can't go on. Not like this. Oh god. Excuse uh, me, sir. What don't is she like? Kill yourself. She's gonna jump out the window now because of you. That's what I was thinking. Through the big open window, dust cold wind freezes the room. Jeez, lady. You got a fire in here. Squeaky ass floorboard. <laughs> On the upper shelf of the antique cupboard are well worn Bible and rosary beads gather dust. One of the humble beds where the nuns sleep. Humble. She has a roommate. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> There's one in this room. Oh, okay. I was gonna go say. An old mirror that hardly reflects. Clean it. Windex. <laughs> a syringe next to a flask with a label that says morphine. Oh, you can't be good. What do you want morphine? So she doesn't get it. She's gonna kill herself. Watch. Can leave the room and come back. See what happens. I should be like mugging. <clears clunk. throat> I was kidding. No. Okay. Just making sure. I was kidding. <laughs> A worn out and faded tapestry of Jesus Christ. That doesn't look like him. Another tapestry, though. I <laughs> I remember from my school days. The city of Dumb dormitory was here. Just one? I guess so. Whoa. Alright. A broken mirror, there is a protruding piece. Pick it up. Oh. What is that? The mirror. Dude, you just picked up glass with your hands? <laughs> the old rusty pipe communicates with other areas in the house. Okay. Why would you talk in the shop? <coughs> Sorry. It's okay, there's a puddle in the shower hole with something shiny under the grating. I can't see it properly. Hmm. Okay. I was about to say block it. Block the... It wouldn't be useful to tie it up. Uh, can you block the shower head with the net or something? No. No? Uh, anything else? Ooh, mirror. In the water or? I don't know. <laughs> Why is the mirror I don't anything? know. I'll just try everything. <laughs> What'd you pick Oh, up? what? Wow! Really? <coughs> oh shit. <gasps> Log. Oh, open it. Postcard. Dear Matthew, it has been several months and I still have not have heard no news from you. My brothers insist that you have abandoned me, but I am sure you remain true. Now that you would never do that for- Hey, isn't this that one sick guy's- Wife, Juliet. I, oh. I, know, I know that you would never do that for me. I know your eye, your heart and your honesty of your eyes. 
I got the suggestion from the hospital in London and pray that it reaches you safely. If that's the case, I want you to know that I will always... Oh, I will be always waiting for you for every order. Yeah, Julia, <laughs> I'll give it to her. Or give it to him. Mr. Vinge, I think this is just you. Oh, thank you. Leave it to me if you'd be so kind. As you can see, my brother's too weak to read it. Well, Matthew, let's see who has written to you. Oh, what's a letter from our mother? Dear Matthew, I hope you're recovering. I wish that your beloved sister and you come back home soon. Lying bitch! Mother needs now... Okay, that was gone fast. What was the point of giving him the postcard? No. Can you talk to the guy? Miss Vinge is making up the letter's contents. No shit. Wait, can you check the bag since she's reading? Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, what we get? <laughs> letters. What are we gonna do with letters? My letters! All the letters <laughs> I wrote to dear Juliet. You've never posted them. But why, Mary? Why could? Why would you do such a thing, Cough? How could you be so cruel? I had to do it, Matthew. You refuse to see how inappropriate a match is she, she is for you. Her only interest is marrying someone of your status, of our family's status. It was for your sake I did this. I did it to protect you from that woman's treachery. No, you only thought about yourself, of your vanity. I can't bear to look upon you anymore, Mary. Leave me be. From this day forth, you are no sister of mine. Burn. <laughs> you dare banish me? I who I who have stayed by your side all by your side all through this illness? Very well, Matthew. You will have your way. I will leave you, and then you will see how very alone you are. Farewell, farewell, brother. Bitch, please. <laughs> Thanks be to the Lord that you have come to reveal my sister's cruelty, sir. Please take this coin as a token of my appreciation. It is my lucky coin, though I hope it serves you better than it has myself. Okay. Maybe? <gasps> I am so fucking <laughs> good at this game, man! Oh, what a beautiful melody. Reminds me of my youth, when she was sexy and full of purpose. <laughs> what? What is go, sexy go. I knew my path then. Oh. May God bless you. For you have given me the sign I was looking for. Oh shit, I just killed that nun, didn't I? Oh? Oh? What do we have here? A lot of dry leaves have accumulated in a hole of this old rusty pipe. They are blocking the water stream. Net. Or your... <laughs> oh my hand. No, I have a block here or something. A log? If I try to put my hand in, I could cut myself. No, no, no. Stone. Duh. Oh. I blunted the sharp edges of the pipe. Now I need not fear being cut. No fear. There is nothing now to impede the water stream. So, is that it? Oh. Oh, snap. The net should catch anything coming down the pipe. If some object happens to pass through here, I think you would stay caught in the net. So the shower, you have to do something with the shower. Again. Oh god! Whoa. Oh god, what is she, is she naked? What is that? No, I think she's dead. Nun's habit and walking stick. There's no doubt uh, it belonged to the nun I spoke to by the window, but where did she go? So she's booty naked right now. Ew! Uh, yeah, no, that's, um... What? Did she just walk to the ocean or what? The fuck? Oh, yeah. Hey, can you look at her stuff again? Maybe she has something on there. Maybe she was a mermaid. No. Hmm. I don't know what to do. Yeah, do I? 
Well, I guess we can call it an episode here. So, <laughs> we're gonna pause it here. Hope you guys enjoyed watching this episode of The Last Story. And I'll see you guys in the next video. So, until then, keep it chunky. Bye. Bye.